Hey Capricorn, I hope you're well. And today's reading will be looking at whoever you're thinking about for the rest of the year. This is someone, uh, it seems to be a newer energy, more youthful demeanor. Um, this person's bringing a more lighthearted approach towards you. They're wanting to send you a message. They're wanting to flirt with you, get to know you better. There is some intrigue here when it comes to you. Let's clarify, why is Page of Wands here for the person on Capricorn's mind? I apologize if you hear the helicopters. Uh, this mic does pick up on everything. Yeah, they're not really, I don't see them very emotionally invested here, but they are sort of enjoying life, perhaps wanting to go for drinks. Sort of a getting to know stage. It's not the most serious, but they are wanting to express love, wanting to offer you love. Knight of Cups, Sun. Seems to be someone who's more so looking for a good time, though. Yeah, playing the field. That is the vibe I'm getting, Capricorn. Your stance, we have Ace of Wands, the Sun in Reverse. Yeah, you may feel the situation is sort of one of those that may fizzle out quickly, right? There is a is there is mutual attraction, fascination with one another. But I don't think you have yeah, you this seems to be a new energy and someone at a distance from you, distance from you with the chariot. You like what you see, but it's more eye candy energy I'm getting. Why is sun in reverse? For Capricorn stance. There's some unhappiness here. Some of you, this has to do with your finances or your job. I see you very much focused on yourself and holding back here. You may be, um, you know, there may be some communication here and there, but I don't see any consistency here. And you're looking for something more committed, something traditional, something that can stand the test of time. So I see you reserving your energy, really, is what is coming through in your stance. How this person will be feeling about you, we have the world, three of wands. I'm definitely getting this as a long distance, short distance, but there's definitely travel involved. This, source, this person is very optimistic and they're exploring what's out there, right? exploring new territory. So it's a very lighthearted, carefree sort of approach. Clarify world here. There may be some differences between the both of you. Can be culture, race, age. Why is the world here? Or how this person, justice in reverse, seven of swords. Yeah, I was getting this. Hmm. Let me see, is this person coming out of something else or are they releasing you? Chariot. Temperance and definite, look at that. Ninth house and chariot, definite distance. And they may feel that is a blockage. Why is three of wands here? Okay, so if there has been distance, this person's been wanting to come back around to you there's they're restless this may be someone you released in the past and they're missing you or they're wanting to come back around four of swords and hermit talk about revisiting a situation they may be waiting on you here as well they're wanting to let go of what was in the past why is the world in reverse or sorry why is the world here Oh, they're wanting to give you love, but they're bringing pages your way. You're coming through as the King of Pentacles. It's not the most trustworthy energy, Capricorn. I have oracles for you, uh, which I did pull off camera to save time, but I haven't looked at them. So I'm curious to see what comes through in them, but I'm definitely getting a very immature energy. But it can also be someone new that you're getting to know, right? So they're bringing pages your way. It doesn't mean the pages can't evolve into the knights, the kings, right? But 
I'm seeing a difference here. It's very obvious. You can't bring the pages to the king or queen, right? How this person will be acting towards you now, this is interesting. They're ignoring you. They're in seclusion here, right? But in their feelings, they were wanting to come back around. They were waiting. But they're not taking action towards you. They're in hermit mode. Some of you, yeah, they're hard at work. Some of you may know this person through work. Hermit and Eight of Pentacles, busy, busy. They have finances on their mind. You're also coming through as a businessman, businesswoman. So I see some mirroring here. Why is Two of Swords coming through? Some of you, they can't come towards you because of the distance, but there is some codependency here. Given that this person isn't in another situation, I don't see third party, but it is a general reading. Yeah, that is what they're moving away from. They're, they were in a lot of stress when it comes to this situation, if you know this person, right? It's someone you have history with. There was a lot of insecurities. They were doubting themselves. There was confidence issues. And that is what they're coming through. They've been putting work into themselves. So they're in a better space now. Their intentions, we have Magician in Reverse, Four of Pentacles in Reverse. Their intentions is, they're not really going out of their way to make anything happen. Why is Magician in Reverse here? Sometimes Magician can be feeling powerless, lack of confidence. Why is Magician in Reverse here? I was seeing the strength in Reverse, so this has to do with their confidence. Ace of Pentacles. Yeah, they want to, they want to unite or reunite. Six of Cups, Ace of Pentacles. But they're not communicating this with you. What this person is feeling and how they're acting is opposite. They want this opportunity with you, Ace of Pentacles. Why is Four of Pentacles in reverse? They feel they have competition. Or there was not seeing eye to eye. There was some bickering with Mercury, right? Perhaps some difficult sinistry when it comes to Mercury. That is definitely coming through. There's some challenges, blockages in the way you communicate. Yeah. Blockages in communication. All your sword cards are coming through in reverse. How you're feeling, we have Knight of Cups, King of Pentacles. You're ready for something serious, something stable. You have a lot to offer uh, financially, but in terms of emotional security, just security in general, you'd make a great long-term partner. You actually are coming through as an ideal partner. King of Pentacles is one of the best kings to get uh, for a marriage partner or just any commitment, right? This king does what they say. They're extremely loyal. And you have a lot of emotion to give to the right person. Clarify Knight of Cups. There's a little bit of resistance to change in your energy, Capricorn. And I don't, I see you having love for someone here, or you just open to new experiences with the night, right? You're holding your cup out. You're healed from whatever happened in the past and you're open, you're ready. 
It's a receptive energy. But I don't see you rushing into anything. Why is King of Pentacles here? Chariot, some of you may be traveling for work or you may have a decision to make in regards to finances or work. Maybe choosing between two. That is coming through, yeah. Nine of Swords in reverse, Hangman, Sun. Sort of focused on yourself here is what I'm getting with the King of Pentacles. Yeah, as I say that, self-love. Eight of Swords in reverse, Empress. You're not wanting, it's almost when you let en new energies enter your energy field, they may throw you off balance, uh, have you overthinking, and they take your time, your attention away from yourself, right? So I see you being very protective of yourself. You're mothering yourself. You're nurturing yourself. Finances look amazing. This is abundance. Empress and the King of Pentacles. Empress and King of Pentacles is Taurus energy, second house. Financial success, but second house also rules self-worth. So if you have been struggling with insecurities, um, no more. You're overcoming that. And you're in a very good position, quite stable. Your outcome, we have King of Swords in reverse and Nine of Pentacles. Yeah, I see you being very detached. Um, putting your emotions aside and really focused on yourself and your growth. Some of you may be students. And this can be a card of a vacation. I see you spending a lot of time by yourself here. Let's see, why is King of Swords in reverse here for Capricorn's outcome? Yeah, you're done. You're giving up on situations that were one-sided, that bring you disappointment. You're healing. You're over what was, and you're moving forward. You're single and you're happy is what I'm getting in your outcome. Clarify, Nine of Pentacles. Look at that. Didn't I say you're single and you're happy? Nine of Cups, Nine of Pentacles. Nines are solo energy. You started off with the Sun in reverse. Look at how you're ending the spread. So if you've been feeling a bit lonely or unhappy, sometimes the Sun in reverse can be a little bit of moodiness or feeling a bit depressed. There's nothing to worry about. It's a phase you'll come out of it, right? And I see you enjoying your own company. It's really up to you. You do have a lot of people wanting you physically. There's a lot of passion. I don't see you very interested. The queen has her back to the ace of wands. I don't think you're looking for something physical. Some of you maybe, right? But I see you wanting something with more depth where there's an equal exchange of energy, giving and receiving. That is what you're wanting, emotional fulfillment in a relationship. Yeah, Queen of Wands, you feeling empowered and you taking charge when it comes to some sort of passion, goals you have. Some of you are getting some, uh, I don't know, something, some good news in regards to your finances, especially if you've been working on some sort of creative project. I see that paying off for you. You're in, you're in work mode is what I'm getting. This person's outcome, we have Nine of Cups, Knight of Wands, Six of Wands in reverse. Well, you're focused on yourself. They're not getting the time attention from you. So they're sort of out seeking it from someone else. I was telling you this is an inconsistent energy and I see that in their outcome. They're selfish and they're very much focused on themselves. I say selfish because we have Knight of Wands in reverse paired next to the Nine of Cups, right? But there's some mirroring here. You're coming through as the Nine of Cups, Nine of Pentacles. They're coming through as the Nine of Cups upright. So you're both sort of in your space, happy. And this person is uh, playing the field. I want to clarify this person's Knight of Cups. So why is Nine of Cups here for their outcome? not feeling that why is nine of cups here for this person on capricorn's mind i see them patiently waiting Breath 
eight of wands in reverse you'll block communication this is over death you're not doing anything this nine of cups energy seemed i was telling you here in their actions that they were working on some sort of financial matter they've been investing a lot of time and energy into something and that is paying off and i was seeing that for you as well so both of you is it's work success coming through wow yeah see i didn't read these we have naughtiness luck orgasm yeah if you want something passionate i definitely see that but this is talking about the sexual chemistry page of wands ace of wands if that is what you're looking for a good time this person can provide that but i don't see them being the most uh stable here for you right oh okay we have distance between us has made me realize just how important you are to me. I made the wrong choices. So there may be some regret. I'm not really seeing that here. Five of pentacles in reverse can be when we're wanting to come back around to someone. But definitely distance. Because I got that in their feelings. World and three of wands. My love has matured. I am now ready for true love. This seems to be your energy. King of pentacles, knight of cups. The chemistry is through the roof. I know I messed up and I have no idea how to fix it, but I'm desperate to get you back. Can be. Page of Wands, Page of Cups, Hermit and Four of Swords in reverse is when we're wanting to come back around. Nine of Pentacles in reverse can be codependency. The issue I had was this person's not taking much action towards you. Some of you, the reason they're not taking, taking action towards you is because king of swords in reverse you've cut them out or you they feel you'll cut them out so there may be some fear and that is the reason they're holding back but you know your situation better um i'm just giving you an example here but there's definitely someone who's regretting their past decision they may have chose someone else or they were playing the field but there's regrets here Yeah, if you forgive me and allow me to enter your life, there's still hope for us. That came through twice. I'm desperate to get you back. If you forgive me, there's still hope for us. I'm not going to be the first one to make a move. Okay, that makes sense why Hermit was here, right? Where there's stubbornness, they're saying they want you to make the first move. I don't see you making the first move. I don't see you doing anything. I'm going to leave you hanging. I only care about my needs. Be careful because this is the energy I was getting from your spread, right? I'm going to leave you hanging. I only care about my needs. This person's not the most consistent and there is a selfish energy here, which I mentioned. For your advice, we have your mirror. Whatever you believe, wasn't I saying you're mirroring one another? Uh, in your outcome specifically, but we have whatever you believe to be true, your lover will mirror back. Get to know what's really going on inside of you and confront your fears. Yeah, there's some unhappiness. The sun in reverse, that is what it's telling you to uh, focus on. Why are you feeling the way you are if you are unhappy? There's some dissatisfaction in your stance, right? I want one more for your advice. What advice do you have for Capricorn? Yeah, yum. I definitely see that orgasm. <laughs> the sexual chemistry is so powerful that they awaken the romantic and the animal inside of you. It can be dangerous if not handled with care. Yeah, because that is all they're bringing towards you. What advice do you have for Capricorn? Sit it out. Take no part in that drama. If they want to be a part of your life, they will make an effort to be in it. Your inaction will cause a reaction. I'm not sure if your action will cause a reaction. They are wanting you back. You're not taking action, so it is saying you're on the right track, but I don't know. What action will this person on Capricorn, Four of Swords, Empress in reverse? There's no growth or expansion here. Okay, Capricorn, so there is an energy here that is wanting to come back around, but if they were selfish in the past, 
it's sort of as fast as it starts, it may end. So that is something you need to be uh, careful of. Protect yourself. You're in a beautiful vibration, right? So we don't want this person to come in and disrupt what you have going. You're going with the flow with Empress. So keep going. I see definite abundance, emotional well-being, financial well-being, overall abundance here in your outcome. But yes, Capricorn, that is what I have for you. Take care of yourself and I will see you next week. And if you would like a personal reading, the info will be in the description box below. Take care of yourself. Bye.